Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here, another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to remove words that can be found in the Windows Spell Checking Dictionary in Windows 10. So as we're all or most of us should be aware, um, there is a spell checking feature built into Windows. And when you type stuff in, often if you're misspelling certain words or key phrases, Microsoft will underline the word in a squiggly red color indicating that the word was spelled incorrectly and if you right click on it will often off, will often offer will, will often offer suggestions as to how the word should be spelled however most of us will often right click on the word and just click on ignore and add it to the dictionary However, uh, sometimes we might have regret doing this and we realize that we might have done it in error and we want to revert this. So in order to go back through the dictionary and undo um, an addition we've added to the Windows dictionary, this tutorial is going to be for you guys. So we're going to start by checking out my Word document here and I typed in a sentence a little while ago. If you're coming over from the previous video about how I show how to add words to the Windows Dictionary, you would know that I created this word here for test and I added two S's in here. And it appears that it's spelled correctly by the Windows spell checking parameters. However, we know that that is obviously not spelled correctly. We're going to go up to the top tab that says File and we're going to left click on that. And then we're going to go down to the bottom of the list here on the left side and we're going to left click on options. On the new window that appears, we want to left click on proofing on the left panel here. Should be third from the top. Left click on custom dictionaries. Now with this selected, we want to left click on edit word list on the right side here. You can see that this incorrectly spelled test is listed here. You can left click on delete all or you can left click on individual items. So I'm just going to delete this one word here from our exclusion list. And then I'm going to left click on OK. OK, we see that it was deleted. So at this point we left click on OK. OK again. And then left click on OK once more. And we see that it has reverted back to being spelled incorrectly. Please note you have to click on OK every time to each one of those windows or else it will not revert back, at least from what I saw. Um, so there's three windows you have to click on OK, OK, and OK. Do not close out of the final window because there's a chance that it will not revert back. So I hope you guys enjoyed this brief tutorial and I will catch you in the next video. Goodbye.